when money is no object to these super-rich people, Elon Musk and his James Bond submarine car. Elon Musk paid $997,000 and for the vehicle, this automobile is unquestionably among the most costly items ever purchased by a millionaire. Musk had once said, watching James Bond in The Spy Who Loved Me drive his impressive Lotus Esprit right off a pier, press a button, and then have it turn into a submarine underwater was fascinating to me as a little child in South Africa. When he discovered that it could not actually transform, Musk was reportedly upset. According to reports, Musk plans on upgrading it with a Tesla electric engine and will then attempt to make it transform for real. Tesla's electric Cybertruck had reportedly been modeled after this car. Jeff Bezos Museum Turned House For $23 million, Jeff Bezos, the richest man in the world, has acquired a textile museum in the center of Washington, D.C. For interior renovations to his taste, he also spent an additional $12 million. The estate is situated in an area where residents like the Obamas, Ivanka Trump, and others live in the neighborhood. A ballroom, wine cellar, whiskey tasting area, movie theater, and more than 1,000 light fixtures are all present throughout the entire structure which also contains about 11 bedrooms. Steve Cohen's 14-foot preserved shark. Plenty of wealthy people have impressive fish tanks, but that is nothing in comparison to owning your own pickled shark. In 2004, billionaire hedge fund manager Steve Cohen purchased what may be the world's most unusual piece of contemporary art, a 14-foot tiger shark preserved in a mixture of alcohol and formaldehyde. Originally purchased for $93,000 by art mogul Charles Saatchi in 1992, Cohen purchased the piece for an undisclosed sum more than a decade later for an undisclosed sum, which New York Magazine reported to be between $8 million and $12 million. Roman Abramovich's Super Yacht It's no secret that yachts are important tools in the elites of the world's competition for superiority. But if racing yachts were a sport, rich Russian businessman Roman Abramovich would be the clear winner. A Boeing 767, an ice boat, and the storied Chelsea Football Club are some of his toys. But his claim to the Eclipse, the largest and most costly yacht in the world, is the most impressive of them all and reportedly came at the cost of $1.2 billion. The 2010 built Eclipse has 11 cabins and suites totaling 6,000 square feet of living area. You can leave your helicopter on her three helicopter landing pad if you happen to miss her as she departs the harbor. Need to rapidly abandon ship? No problem. The three person submarine on the yacht has a 160 foot depth limit. The Sultan of Brunei's car collection. Being a Sultan is beneficial. Need evidence? Just take a look at the Sultan of Brunei's automobile collection. He is the head of a nation that is a little bigger than Delaware. His illustrious fleet includes between 5,000 and 7,000 of the rarest, finest, most costly, and best performing automobiles in the world, with a total market worth of at least $5 billion, according to reports. The Star of India a $14 million Rolls convertible that holds the title of being the most expensive automobile in the world, is one of the greatest gems, along with 21 Lamborghinis, 452 Ferraris, and 604 Rolls Royces. Clive Palmer's Titanic Some wealthy people opt for high-end yachts. Clive Palmer, an Australian businessman, and politician, however, will only accept the most illustrious ship in history. But since it sank in 1912, the Titanic has been submerged in the Atlantic Ocean. Palmer was resistant to being persuaded and ordered Titanic II, a virtually perfect copy of the sinking nine-deck White Star Line ship, complete with the grand staircase from the 1997 film but modified for contemporary travel. Another crucial point is that Titanic 2 has enough lifeboats to accommodate everyone on board. It reportedly costs anywhere around $425 million to $570 million. Carlos Slim Museum in Mexico 
Owners of art collections and owners of museums are the two different categories of art collectors. The richest person in Mexico is Telecom Mogil Carlos Slim, who has an impressive net worth of $71.4 billion. He held the title of the richest man in the world in 2011. In order to display his renowned collection, he opened the Museo Somaya in that year, an $800 million, six-story, metallic, and windowless art museum. Slim owns more than 65,000 items in total, including some of the most valuable pieces of art from Europe and Mexico. William Koch's Billy the Kid Photo When we hear the name Koch Brothers, we don't usually picture William Koch, instead, we picture Charles and David Koch, a billionaire sibling team known for their business empire Koch Industries, and significant political clout. The third and richest Koch brother, William, is a huge fan of the history of the Wild West and is enormously wealthy. When he spent $2.3 million in 2011 to acquire the only authenticated image of renowned outlaw Billy the Kid, he scored the genre's crown jewel.